If your dog is pregnant, there will be a number of signs for you to look out for, some of which are easier to spot than others. It's important to be aware of early signs of pregnancy because the canine gestation period averages 63 days, which doesn't give you much time to prepare. Today, we'll tell you how to know if your dog is pregnant or not. Number 8. Key Facts About Dog Pregnancies Fertile Seasons If your bitch is entire, hasn't been spayed, she is likely to come into season once every 8 months, although this can be affected by the seasons of other entire bitches that she is with. A season can last for up to 3 weeks. If your dog is in heat but you don't want her to become pregnant, keep her on a lead on walks and ensure that your garden is escape proof to stop her from jumping over a hedge or fence to get to a mate. Gestation period. A dog's gestation period is typically 63 days or about nine weeks post conception, but this can vary on either side. This is generally the same for all dogs, regardless of their breed. Litter size. The number of puppies a dog will have can vary widely depending on the breed. Smaller breeds tend to have three to four, while larger breeds, on average, have five to eight puppies. Nonetheless, this is very dependent on the individual, and even a vet may not be able to predict the exact number your dog will have. Weaning time. A bitch will begin weaning her puppies from as little as three weeks after birth and is likely to have them fully weaned by about eight weeks. Number seven, signs of dog pregnancy. There are some physical and some behavioral signs that you will see if your bitch is pregnant, but dogs can also have phantom pregnancy. A phantom or pseudo pregnancy is when a female dog shows a lot of signs of being pregnant, but doesn't produce puppies. This can occur about a month or two after she has had in heat, which is why it can be mistaken for a real pregnancy, as the symptoms occur at a similar time as they would if she was in whelp. If you think that your dog may be pregnant, these are some key traits to look out for. Enlarged nipples, milk production that occur even in pseudo-pregnancies, vaginal swelling and discharge, tiredness and appearing calmer, morning sickness, nesting behaviors, changes in appetite, firmer stomach than normal, and gaining weight rapidly about a month into the gestation. However, bear in mind that signs such as changes in appetite or weight gain can also be symptoms of something else, so the best thing to do is to check with your vet. There are several signs that will tell you if puppies are on the way. A slight secretion of discharge may occur about a month after mating. Her teats will stand out both in color and size around 30 days after mating, and they may even secrete a semi-transparent liquid. A pregnant dog's appetite will increase during the second half of pregnancy, so keep in mind that you'll have to modify her diet accordingly. Your vet can confirm pregnancy by means of a canine pregnancy test, which measures hormone levels from day 21 to 25 of pregnancy onwards, or using ultrasound from day 20 to 22 onwards. From the 30th day onwards, your vet will be able to perform a physical examination to find out how many puppies your dog is expecting. This test is not always accurate, so you may find yourself with more puppies than expected. Number six, how to tell if your dog is pregnant. Dogs don't have the option of picking up a pregnancy test kit from the pharmacy, which means we have to rely on other methods to determine if a dog is pregnant. The most accurate way to tell if a dog is pregnant is through diagnostic testing. Palpation. If you know the date your dog was bred, your veterinarian can perform abdominal palpation, starting at approximately the 28-30 day mark. At this stage in the pregnancy, 
The puppies feel like little golf balls or grapes depending on the size of the dog. These balls are fluid-filled sacs surrounding the fetus. Abdominal palpation should not be attempted without the assistance of a veterinarian as it could damage the puppies. The sacs lose their distinct shape after one month, so the timing of this test is important. Ultrasound Alternatively, your veterinarian can do an ultrasound between 25 and 35 days of gestation. An ultrasound can usually detect fetal heartbeats, giving you an estimate of the number of puppies the bitch is carrying. The puppy's heartbeats are two to three times faster than the mother's. Hormone test at about 25 to 30 days of gestation, your veterinarian can perform a blood test to measure the dog's hormone levels to see if she is producing the hormone relaxin. X-ray. X-rays are one of the most effective ways to determine if a bitch is pregnant. However, this is best done at 55 days or more as the puppy's skeletal systems doesn't show up on an x-ray until then. An x-ray at this time allows you to get an accurate count of the number of puppies, which will prepare you to know when your dog is finished delivering. Number five, what to do. The only way to really be sure if your bitch is pregnant before her giving birth is to take her to the vet. There are several ways a vet can check whether your dog is pregnant. One way is to gently feel your dog's tummy. Your dog can also have a blood sample taken for a pregnancy test if she is early on in her gestation, or she might have an ultrasound, very much like a human pregnancy. Later on in your dog's pregnancy, the vet might ask you to return for an x-ray. This is a good way to check on the puppy's progress and also see how many are in her tummy. Number four, how can you know for sure? You can't exactly run out to the drugstore to pick up a home pregnancy test for your dog. If you suspect she is pregnant, you should visit your veterinarian. After around day 21, they will be able to run a hormone test to give you a definitive answer. Your vet may prefer to do an ultrasound after day 20 or so in order to allow them to see the puppies growing inside of her. Number three, how long are dogs pregnant? Typically, the gestation period of a dog is between 60 and 65 days. Because dog pregnancies are so much shorter than that of humans, she may be well into her term before you are even aware of it. It's a good idea to get to know the signs of a pregnant female so you can prepare for the changes a litter of puppies will introduce into your life. Number two, what to do when it's time to deliver. Your dog is built to handle this on her own. Her instincts will guide her through the process from start to finish, but there are ways you can make things easier on her. After all, she's part of the family. Simply being present will allow you to soothe her along the way. Gentle petting before the puppies begin to arrive and soothing words will help her feel more at ease. It will also allow for you to step in should any complications arise. If you notice her straining without producing any pups or see a discolored discharge, you should contact your vet immediately. She will naturally look for a quiet, warm, and comfortable place to give birth. You can help her by making a cozy nest for her with old blankets and towels and by keeping the activity in your home to a minimum during her labor. Some people like to build a whelping box in order to keep the puppy safe and contained during birth and early life. Your dog may also feel more secure if she is able to seclude herself in such a box. Number one, what to do with newborn puppies. There is a lot to know about raising puppies. Fortunately, nature has programmed your dog with that information and she will instinctively do most of the hard work without you having to lift a finger. Your job is to oversee the whole operation and step in if you notice a problem. You may need to break a puppy out of its amniotic sac or prevent your dog from crushing or suffocating them during and after labor. After the labor is over, be sure to change the bedding where your dog and her puppies will live regularly and keep her well fed and hydrated. 
You may need to help a runt or two to feed as the litter will typically have a few food hogs that push the smaller pups out of the way. Do let us know in the comments if you think your dog may be pregnant. Please subscribe to The Amazing Dogs. Thanks for watching.